Alright guys, it is me Hitman Mac once again with another GTA 5 online video and this time is going to be yet another showcase for another lowrider vehicle and this time it is going to be the Willard Faction. Now the Willard Faction is a car you got to buy in the uh, in the new lowrider update for I think it's about like $30,000 or something like that. It's insane, it's definitely like my new favourite car out of everything. Um, as with the last one, I decided to go with a more classy kind of paint scheme. Rather than lots of real extravagant decals, I just went for some plain gold pinstriping with some nice classy gold wheels, some big old SUV wheels <laughs> that just make it look like an absolute beast. But anyway guys, yeah, this is actually a pretty simple car build. Um, I mean, the upgrades and stuff are very plentiful on these cars, like there's a lot on them that you can actually put on them. As you can see, mine's kind of scraped at the front, but never mind that. Uh, yeah, mine's looking real plain. I just went for some gold interior with gold wheels and gold pinstriping. And then, of course, the plain white paint with the uh, white shift which is a uh, which is a dice um, and of course the white steering wheel but anyway guys let's get straight to it see what we can do to this car there's some pretty cool upgrades on this I mean a lot of cool stuff you can put on this in Benny's Automotives down in Strawberry in Los Santos so anyway yeah we're gonna go here as I said everything is crazy expensive here I mean everything is expensive but anyway first of all the exhausts and stuff they're pretty cool I mean just regular bog standard exhausts I went for these ones because they're bigger than everything else and bigger is way better but um, yeah, you just go for like things like the power bullet hood, which I'm gonna consequently put on. Um, horns, standard stuff, regular horns. You could always be able to get. I mean, a lot of these are just regular ones. <laughs> Hydraulics. I mean, look at those pumps. The pumps in this thing look insane. The, the pumps you can put in are just so so beast. I just, they're just. Oh my god, what is this? So much shiny, so much pump. Anyway, <laughs> um, the trim stuff, pretty much the same as the last one where you have all like really cool like leopard print trim and stuff like it makes no sense um, the ornaments some of the cool mariachis and stuff like that i think i have grim reaper on this oh i don't have anything damn it um some cool ass dials um there's everything so expensive is really disappointing i was kind of kind of disappointed with uh with gta and rockstar after making this so expensive but anyway yeah, all the all the cool stuff you can put on. I kind of I kind of like to go for cool color schemes and stuff. So I mean, things like this pisswasser one or the dice and stuff would be kind of more suited to my car. I kind of went for the dice because it looks really cool. Um, all these like plaques and stuff you can put in the back. They're pretty cool. Like all the, they're white, so I kind of want to put them on, but I just don't have enough money. It's so depressing. I just want money. Ugh. White knee, uh, so terrible. Anyway, the ICEs, uh, again, not, probably not going to put them on because you can't actually see them in the back of my car, which kind of sucks. Um, and then, of course, you can change the light colors and stuff. Um, I just have them on white because my car is white. So, um, yeah, lights, regular <laughs> lights, neons. Uh, and then, of course, the decals. Now, the decals in this car are insane. I mean, look at them. They're just... They just make so little sense, it's great. <laughs> but uh, I just went for the basic gold pinstriping. I didn't really want to go for anything more extravagant than that. Um, everything else is kind of a little bit too much. Um, the gold outline pinstripe was just, well, border pinstripe rather, was just so much better. It looked so much nicer, cleaner, much more sleek, and it just looks so much better on the car. It matched with the gold wheels with the crim trom, crim trom? Chrome trim. It just looked so, so good. And um, next, obviously all the transmission and stuff are basic things, but I mean, look at these woofers. Look at the subwoofers you can put in the back of this thing. It's just a huge sound bar at the back. It just looks so good. I just want, uh, it's just not fair. It's just not fair. I don't have enough money for anything. <sighs> anyway, the wheels on this car are actually in this SUV class, stock rims, and they're the Cognoscentis. These are the ones that do come with the Cognoscenti Cabrio. Um, I just think they look insane on this car. I wanted a really nice big chunky SUV wheel to put on it um, Because I think when it's sitting pretty really low scraping off the floor It's just it's, they're just the kind of wheels you want to be rolling on. They just look so cool Anyway, the windows on this I did go for light smoke because once they're too dark You literally can't see a thing inside so I kind of want to see some of my interior But yeah guys, that's pretty much it. I guess uh, there's not really that much more else left on the car to do um, I guess it's a pretty easy easy car to do. I think, I think this thing costs like 33,000 to upgrade to the lowrider class ex Except for whereas the Primo is 400,000 uh, Which is crazy expensive. I mean, it's so so expensive The only thing about this is like the Primo and all costs like like 30,000 for a turbo and 9,000 for the top engine upgrade This thing costs 30,000 for that for the top engine upgrade and 50,000 for a turbo and like 40,000 for a transmission and all. It's just crazy They cost so much money 
But uh, yeah, guys, I guess that's it. Um, as I said, I kind of like more classy kind of looking car builds um, on most of my cars. I don't really like real extravagant, real ricey, or like real just like, I don't know. It's, I hate all the real, real weird, really weird liveries and stuff. I don't know. But anyway, <laughs> that's pretty much it, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. Make sure you check out some of my other videos, including my Call of Duty GTA and Destiny videos. And as always, guys, I've been Hitman. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Hitman out.